everyone and welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a shorter video and it's what I got for Christmas that's Harry Potter related um, I got a few things for myself and then my husband gifted me um, three items that I've been wanting for a while now um, but first off I wanted to talk about these t-shirts now I've seen other people on YouTube um, that had them. They're the book cover shirts. Um, and I've been wanting them for a while. And they have them for every book that is out, obviously. And, um, so I went over to the out of print website and they were having a sale on them. So I got all these, all the cover books is what I call them. Um, t-shirts for $7.95 a piece so I, I, I went and researched it more because I thought $7 is cheap for Harry Potter um, t-shirts and they're actually losing their um, licensing and they're all on clearance so if you are looking for Harry Potter t-shirts and here's the other the other one I'm wearing it's the Goblet of Fire go to the out of print website and see if they still have your size and I know they're still $7.95 on the website um when I looked uh last night because I've I got all I was able to get all of the books except for um Order of the Phoenix I believe they didn't have my size and um the women's um so I wasn't able to get that one but I was able to get all the rest of them so I got myself those shirts for Christmas so that was actually um a good deal you can't pass that up so the other items I got were gifted to me by my husband um, it's the house crest pins and then the Hogwarts crest and it came in this nice wooden case um, it's easy to display and it looks really good on the shelves um, these are our noble collection item and then I got, oh, I was really excited about this one, the Slughorn's Hourglass. I saw it last year when we went to the Wizarding World and fell in love with it. But I live in Indiana and there was no way I was going to try to buy it there and try to get it home in my suitcase. So I am extremely happy that I was able to get it for Christmas. And then the last item he got me um, was Hagrid's Lantern. which is a replica that I wouldn't have even thought about getting. Um, I never saw it on their website, I suppose. I didn't look for it, but I am so glad he actually got it for me because it is so nice and it looks so good displayed. So that is um, all the items I got this year. Like I said, it's a short video this time. Um, I am trying to come up with more ideas, so if you want to follow me on this journey thank you for putting up with me i'm learning um this is my second video so i just like to share my love of harry potter and it gives me an escape from the everyday world that um because it's such a bad world right now and it's nice to be able to just find something that you love and put your whole heart into it and just do it what you need to do and um, I feel like collecting Harry Potter stuff and talking to other Harry Potter fans is my way of escaping the world that we live in right now um, I know that I want to do a room tour my husband built this room for me to, for my collecting things and as you can see some of my stuff behind me I have items that I will slowly be showing and I will do a whole room tour um, when we finally finish it but keep following me keep, keep share it with other Harry Potter fans if you want um, and if you have any questions I'd like to answer them you can also find me on instagram at golden trio fan one um, i put up daily photos and you can ask me questions there if you want 
Um, well, thank you for watching my video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.